Hello and welcome again to an another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you that how you can decrypt any audio file from Wireshark. In our last video, I have shown you how you can install Wireshark properly. So I hope that video find you any helpful. Let's continue with our today's video. So if you see, I have a Wireshark open now and over here I have two files. This is called the pickup file. These are captured by my web server. So let me just put it over here. So I'm going to open this file. If you drag and drop it, it will open all the details. Those who are working in VoIP, they might know what is these things is looking. It's uh, telling all the SIP responses. So if I go to the VoIP calls, and if you can see this is the web call and this is the file id so let me add this one okay this is now more visible to you as you can see this is all the details which are looking we can see the station like invites message header message body and everything like what was the codec used as you can see it used the g711 and g711u means ALO and ULO which was used in this particular call so if we go to the telephony and wipe calls and select all of these and flow sequence we can see all the details where the call was coming from and each and everything so but if we try to play the stream over here it's not going to play the file why is that because because it's missing the RTP. To do that, we are going to put both of the files at the same time. Make sure you have the RTP file. In my case, this was the RTP file. That's why all the details was not showing. This is the signaling file. But if your web server generate both of them at same file, you don't have to worry about. But my web server generate them in two different sections. So I have to put them over here as you just so I just drag those things over here okay did that now if we go to the telephony web calls and select all those those things and play stream you, you will see the live call this is the RTP that was selected this is for the customers side and this is for the agent side so let me play a little of these files hello and this is just a testing uh, okay as you just listen this this was the recording that i did for this uh, file so i can make this video so yeah this is for the agent voice and this is for the customer voice you can analyze both of the files from here so this is how you can decrypt the audio file you can also save this file if you wanted to save this recording all you have to do just select these things then click again to the play stream once this option is appear press ctrl plus a again select both of them then as you can see this option is now visible but before if i deselect it these options are not visible so we have to select all by pressing ctrl plus a now it's saying that we can export we export this file click over here we can we are going to do this stream synchronize audio file let's save this file on our download folder i'm going to give a name like uh, test and this is the file extension you can choose save now if we go to the downloads this was the file if i play file hello this is just a testing okay as we just hear this was the file so yeah you can also save it or like export it as an audio if you wanted to share with your client or your service provider uh, so it will be very helpful so if you find this video any helpful please like the video and subscribe my channel and i'm going to see you to the next video thank you